Today I'll be introducing the subject mechanical vibration and I'm going to commence by trying to answer the question what is vibration? Vibration is simply the to and fro motion of a whole or part of a body about a mean position. And how does vibration occur? Vibration begins by Firstly, the displacement of an elastic body from equilibrium position by an external force. And this is followed by the restoration by internal elastic forces, which tries to bring the body back to its original position. We know that inertia is the tendency of a body to remain in its state of continuous motion or rest, except it's being compelled to by an external force. So because of this inertia that is present, as the elastic forces are returning the pull of the body back to equilibrium position, the body tends to move past the equilibrium position again. And the elastic force, which I mentioned, would want to, would, of course, tend to make the body return back or move towards the equilibrium position again. And this process continues on and on. However, if dissipating forces, which usually is in the form of damping, whether dry friction or viscous damping, when they are present in the system, would dissipate energy from the system from time to time, and the system would eventually come to rest. And this usually is the case. What are the different types of vibration? Vibration can be classified in different forms. Vibration can be termed as free and forced vibration. So we have what we call free vibration and we have what we call forced vibration. By free vibration, we are referring to a form of vibration in which the force of excitation, that force that brings about the initial displacement of the body or part of the body, is taken away from the system while the system is made to vibrate on its own. Why force vibration is a form of vibration that the force of excitation remains in course of the vibration of the system. So free vibration is the vibration in which the force of excitation is taken away from the system. Why force vibration is the form of vibration in which the force of excitation remains and causes continuous oscillation of the system. Vibration can also, also be classified as damped and undamped vibration. A vibration system is said to be damped if there are present of frictional forces or dissipating forces in the system, which tend to take away the vibration energy from time to time and eventually bring the system to rest. While a vibration is said to be undamped if there is absence of damping forces, but this is hardly the case. Otherwise, we would have a vibration that would progress on and on till eternity. Then also vibrations are classified into longitudinal, transverse and torsional vibration. Simply put, longitudinal vibrations are those ones in which the vibration involves a to and fro motion along the axis of the body that is vibrating. Why transverse vibration is one that is vibrating to and fro perpendicular to the axis of the body. And finally, torsional vibration is one that involves a to and fro twisting or a to and fro rotational motion of a vibrating system. Thanks for watching. To see more videos on mechanical vibration, click on the subscribe button and hit on the notification bell.